So today we're headed to pick up a pump organ for me. This should be an interesting project. Flashback. Of flashback. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of restore work on it, but I've always had an interest in organs, so uh, this makes it so I can actually own one. <laughs> so yeah, first we need to clean my room, so let's get to that. Well, the time has come for me to give away my Kimball Valencia electric organ, which you can see right there. I got this organ in Pennsylvania maybe 12 years ago, uh, a little bit more, from a, a special friend down there who went to our church, the one that my dad pastored. Uh, Mrs. Waltz was her name, and she was pretty short. I, <laughs> I outgrew her when I lived in Pennsylvania, and I was only like eight. But um, it's sad, I really don't wanna have to give this thing up, but because of the new reed organ, which really fits what I need a whole lot better, I want to have something acoustic instead of an electronic organ. Because of that, it's time to give this thing away, and I hope and pray that uh, a good owner finds it and it's not just destroyed or something, because that would be sad. But yep, yeah, we're gonna be giving it to Goodwill. So here are the stops. We have tibia, four foot through 16 foot. 16 foot doesn't really work. We have piccolo, two foot. We have strings, which I think is eight foot. Trumpet, 16 foot. Trombone, 16 foot. Clarinet, 16 foot. We have vibrato. We have flute, diapason, eight foot. Um, string, eight foot, I think. Then piano, banjo, marimba for the lower keyboard. Then we have this switch, which I think uh, the long sustain one actually disables the entire organ. <laughs> There's some electronic problems with it. And then over here we have the, uh, uh, this changes the mode that the organ's playing in. Um, this is actually a one key chord thing. So you, you push a key like this is C, uh, and you get a chord, um, instead of having to actually play the chord yourself. First keyboard, second keyboard, this key actually doesn't work. This is the solo volume, so this controls this. Uh, this is the pedal volume, so it controls these pedals down here and also the volume of the bass on the lower keyboard. And then this is supposed to be solo, but in like the, the balance between accompaniment and solo, but it doesn't really work. Um, that's the power switch, obviously. Uh, these are supposed to be rhythm, but they don't actually work. Then we have tempo, and this doesn't work either. Uh, never has, that's for the beat that has to do with this right here. But, uh, yep. That is the organ, um, made in like 1964-ish, around there somewhere. So now I guess I'm gonna play one more song on this thing, and then we have to carry it downstairs and into the trailer.
Next time on the Reed Organ Restoration Series. So it's been a couple of days now and my room, as you can tell, is really, really empty. So here's the organ currently as it stands. I have already taken off this first cover below the keys and I've taken off this second cover in front of the pedal straps and I've also taken off the back cover here. Yeah.